try and stick it out. Oh. Hey. He's got a headlock now as well. Uh, go, oh dear. I'm still much wrong with it now. Yeah, I'm over. I've got an extra pair of socks on. I dropped a couple of the pads in my boots. How you doing? How you doing? Right, turn. Yeah. Do you want me to come so long? Oh, obviously not. You won! Do you want me to come on? <laughs> I'm going to have trouble with this. Is it on? Yeah, it's on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hello. Beeped. Yeah. Well. yeah. We're good to go. Get to go on my... Uh, yeah! <sighs> <sighs> Let's plug the phone in. Mother plugger. Nice a couple of Parland sticky pads on there, the eight pads. Lovely. I'll have to look at them each uh, jackets out. Yeah, they look good, they do, don't they? Well, I had some back from America years ago, a pair of socks, and they've got, uh, you put batteries, drop the batteries in the side of them. The big fattens are, that's the only thing. And um, it just warms your towels up. Great, great idea. But you got the like the batteries on the side. I used to use them for fishing. I bet you look like you got a tag on, didn't you? <laughs> oh, I felt like I got my tag on again. <laughs> Richie's out. Richie's out. He's out on tag. Not really. Don't put that on there, please, because I've never got <laughs> yet. Not yet. No intent to. I don't intend to get caught. <laughs> yeah, that's it. I like it round here. Yeah. There is an house here somewhere where the mother in law had the dog from. Yeah. Not around this area. Yeah. It's the posh dog. Some, somewhere around here. Yeah. The debris. I think this is it. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, that's it. Oh yeah. Yeah, the debris in oh, there. Oh, yeah. kennels and food. I know we've got a dog, right? I joking, we are. But um, you, you might have to edit this bit. And, um, oh, what you done now? You kept. Uh, what is it? Oh, look at this. Oh. Bit of fox hunting. Oh, oh, this dog, it oh. about kept barking all the while. Getting on my carry nerves. I says, um, well, I've heard nothing about a dog barking, so I went on um, Google. I Googled somewhere. Oh. 
and there was a little piece on there saying if you get a little bit of um, not a lot a little bit of petrol only like a capful petrol petrol yeah, <laughs> yeah. Put, put it in the dog's food uh -huh. stopped and barking I thought no that, that can't be bloody right so that's stupid so anyway it was getting oh yeah the dog we've just passed the dog <laughs> <laughs> so anyway I wait for them to go out because this dog's got like this little flap kept coming out proper nightmare it was so when it went back in, I knew nobody was in like, because I'd done a bit of wrecking. And uh, I got this little cap of petrol, put it in the, the dog food, come back and was watching through the bedroom window. Really, I should have uh, got, <laughs> I should have got the GoPro out. Oh, I should. The dog comes out after about 15 minutes of me waiting about like, and then he goes, he goes up to the dog food, sniffs at it, I thought, yeah, gonna have that. All of a sudden, he eats it. Then about five minutes later, starts running around the garden never seen nothing like it like oh, man like a rocket oh. all of a sudden stopped on its bag back legs in the air why are you joking you ain't, you ain't kidding did ya no nah, it ran out of petrol i said that i said that when it's uh, at work in the staff room yeah. and i says to uh, a couple of the women because they're my like proper dog lovers out there well i wouldn't do anything like that anyway and um I says to him, I says, uh, I told him that story, they all, they all felt it, they all, felt they all says, oh, did it, I was waiting, there was a bit of a pause, when I says, it stopped, went on its back, legs in the air, and uh, a couple of them went, oh, what a shame, and then they went, did it die, I went, no, nah, it ran out of petrol. <laughs> I was thinking, when you said, I was thinking, oh, I'm going to have to edit this out of the video. Yeah, RSPCA, oh, but I, I did, on, RSPCA knocking on the door. I did say to him, I says, uh, I oh, know you lot of animal lovers, I says, but don't report me to the RSPCA. <laughs> That's what I says to them. But when I told them, they looked like horrified, but then they, they, they walked out of the staff room laughing about it. Yeah, I'm the air and hounds now, I'm passing all oh, dog no. things. They're joking apart now, but mate, uh, they're calling him the dog whisperer. Why? Because he, he can, like, he's, he's really good, like, he, he trains dogs, mm. and he guaranteed to stop them, you know, the pups when they're yapping. Yeah. Well, I'd say with bad eight months old they start yapping are they oh. so I took him to my friend's house I says I don't think it would work he went in and goes oh, we're, oh where's your dog like blah 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 and he says there look yapping can't stop him so he calls the dog over takes his shoe off rocks it now just touches it on his nose stops barking and I said blow me now and the mum went I can't believe that I says how the hell did you do that he says, hush puppies. <laughs> 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 oh, I've got the sap uh, dog jokes coming. I don't know anymore, though. Dog jokes. No, I remember um, a few months ago, my brother got barred from his local pub. He got what? He got barred from the pub. Why? Because he, he took the cat to the pub. Took the cat to the pub? Yeah, yeah. He took the cat to the pub, walked in, obviously, we was at the bar. He comes in and he puts the cat on the bar. And um, the barman said, no, you've got to get out, mate, you call it that line on the bar. He said, it's a line, it's a cat. <laughs> some mad jokes about it, though. You imagine some of the people I'm watching this, probably in America, and that, they can't understand our accents. Ah. they got a clue what we're going on about. Mm. Bit of black country humour. Back in the days, I used to be able to take your uh, dogs in the pub. You could yeah. take a, you could take, I think it was in the bar area, only like... I was, in, I was in years ago when he, well, I was on eight, 18, so I was going back 30, a oh, long time ago. Well, and, a long uh, time ago. Very long time ago. And there's a bloke in there, he got this staffy, and he, he cocked his leg up and he was licking his, his uh, you know what, his, I says to the bloke joking about, like, I says, I wish Dar could do that. He says, give him a biscuit and he might let you. <laughs> you don't get that one, did you? <laughs> <laughs> so I was looking at the sat at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> the campsite's down here, where you get to. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. kill! I nearly went straight for that.
slow. I don't know how they do that when they do a slow wheelie. Like yeah. they get it up and it's just like nearly, it's nearly stopped. I'm just like sort of creeping along. God, how the hell do that? Cause these are heavy bikes. It is a lot of wheeling yours. Yeah, it's quite heavy. What's yours? 1250? No, 1200 this is. Well, 1198. But then modern bikes are a lot lighter. Right? They're yeah. like Matt's bike. Because there's, there's, really light, light, there's a lot more plastic on them, aren't there? So. Yeah. Yeah, really light, Matt. I thought he was light anyway when I sat on him. I, mean, I took it for a little spin, but. But I'll see him and Bill. If you've still got the power there and them light, it's got to be better, right? Yeah. If, you, if you could drop it on you or something. Was it, was it the one where they went camping? No, he was at his arm. He, he, he pulled his bike out. I don't know if he's going to clean it or something. And, um, like, it's by the side of his house. And it actually... F I don't know how... I'm just trying to think how it, it happened. But it, like, it falls. And, it, you know, the weight, the momentum. He starts to go and he's, he's holding on to it. But he has to let it go and it hits the side of his house. But it, like, uh, rips his... Um, I think he breaks his screen, it rips his side mirror off and then scuffs the side of his like and he's proper good but he was proper gutted and I, <laughs> I felt I thought there was a, a trick when I seen it when he says something about it bike drop or something and I thought there was gonna be something else on there but he was proper gutted. You could tell mind you, I was when yeah. I dropped my four hundred. I done the same because the mirror was attached to the front um Yeah, it normally cracks the fire and done it. Yeah, it was connected to the fairing, and when I'd, I, I put my side stand down, but I hadn't like it hadn't just clicked, so it, it had just, just as soon as I got off, it, it caught me actually on the side of the leg, and uh, as a wing mirror, it, well side mirror, it sorry, it ripped the front fairing off completely, and then was screen, thought yeah, oh, and I was like, I went up home and I was nearly crying, <laughs> <laughs> so she wants to marry you, says my bike says you've had an accident, I says. <laughs> Yeah, it says you were right, I went, not me, it's my bike. <laughs> so I dropped it. This is, uh, you just had to get it done. Yeah, so I did more at the petrol station when I fell over. <laughs> I put the stand down, put my yeah. foot down, and I think my foot had slipped on diesel. Oh, I've done that, but on gravel. Yeah, so I went over, hit the petrol pump, the bike fell on me, <laughs> and it punched the side of the radiator. Bloody. Yeah, man. I was going over, like, come on, <laughs> I've dropped my bike. <laughs> <laughs> We're like big kids, are we, really? Yeah. Something happens to your boy, you're proper really yeah. gutted and that, are you? The only thing then though, I was I was only earning like 29 quid a week. Yeah. So when you're thinking, oh Jesus Christ, you know, when you've done some damage to the bike, it's going to take you like six months to pay for the parts. That's right. Yeah.
Come on, son. This is our first, our first trip out with no rain. And we've had fog. I know. Life's more important than money. We always say that, oh, I do that. I'd love to have money, but yeah. as long as you're made, I suppose. Yeah. But sometimes. As you said, we're do, you know, we're doing this, enjoying ourselves on a thousand pound bike. Ah, I see. Yeah, I've spent 14 grand on Amazon on stuff, but. <laughs> oh, on gadgets. Yeah. <laughs> the bike. I love gadgets. Yeah. I love gadgets, though. Yeah, I suppose if you weighed me bike in there with all the gadgets on it, it's worth about 22 grand. Oh, that's just in scrap value, yeah. right? <laughs> weight. That's just in phone holders. Yeah. I'll be riding shotgun. This is the key. Oh! I don't know why this keeps going off. I think. Let me just turn. Auto lock. Let's just turn the auto lock off for now. Okay. Let's do it, oh. man. Well, let's go. Actually, let's try a. Oh, I'm going to switch the GoPro on just to see. Pro. I've got the angle set right on this. Faffing about again. <coughs> Rich, you've got some petrol, really, for God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> I should have got diesel. It's a bit cheaper, eh? Yeah. I reckon he'd run me on the garden a bit longer on diesel. I wonder if they ever made a diesel motorbike. I don't know. Because it works under compression, doesn't it, diesel? I don't know how it works. It'd have to be a big old lump of an engine. Well, I don't know. They do like uh, a. Do they do a litre diesel engine? I've, I've seen a, a 1.3 Corsa diesel. Oh, yeah. I remember them. Oh. So, yeah, you could. Could get one of them. Lumpy in a Vespa. That's where we're headed, up there. Oh, up there. Up there. Right up the alley. Come reminds on, son. Me, reminds me of Wales. Come the on, son. The sun is out. Is that sun? Uh, the sun will come out tomorrow. Oh, car boot. Oh. Car boot sale. I've been to a car boot sale for years. Uh, I've never found any car boots for sale, though. Wellington boots. I was in a bit on that uh, wild bat and he was like, took all his wheels off and had them powder coat and everything. We should not one. Stripping his bike, him and it, he got, is it he gone? Is it he gone? No, he's yeah. funny, he? So like, I think he might be a mechanic. Yeah, that he gone, I think he. Uh... Whenever something goes wrong, he got like he does all the fixing. So yeah, he's on. He's, I reckon he's like. I he think might it, be a proper mechanic, like well, mechanic, something. He's probably just clever, eh? Like good with machines like that. Yeah, I think I think that's why we're lacking in our group. <laughs> we need a mechanic. <laughs> we need someone who's clever. That's it. <laughs> As long as you get out. Oh, so you what, riding with a bit of sunshine. We've ne we've That's ne rare. We've never experienced it before. No, we've just had bad luck, haven't we? When the week before we went to uh, Aberystwyth. Oh, no, it was gorgeous, wasn't it? Red hot. 30 degrees. Bloody What's that doing? Oh, it's a jogger. I thought I was running away from something. What's he done? I'll oh, say that when I'm in the car. Go. What's he doing? Somebody running down the street. Some. What do you mean? What's he done? That's his hole. Oh, still jogging. <laughs> Thought he just broke in somewhere. Oh, you, know, you said that on the last video. 
Did I? Yeah. It's been boring now. Yeah, I don't, I don't expect to hear it on the next video. Just edit it out. Yeah. No, I'm leaving it in. Okay. And then we'll look out for the third time you say it. Well, I, I okay. might say that next time. Oh, sun blinded me. Mulvan Link. That's an old Morgan on there. That's where they do, mate. That's old Morgan. Bell. I don't, you don't see many of them out. I ain't seen many of them stockists anyway, Bell. Uh, there used to be a, a, a lot of them when we was young, Bell. I've got the classic helmet, the classic helmets. John Green, you plonk. Do you want the job in front of a while? <laughs> <laughs> You've been sacked! <laughs> I think Steve thought, what the hell's he doing? <clears throat> Steve's probably thought that all the way on this journey. Steve is looking at that mound in front here, are you? Yeah. <clears throat> Keep clear. Harper's Bazaar. So a bit of army and navies. Oh, yeah. Morgan Motors, down there. Aye. <clears throat> yeah, just keep your eyes open now, because I think... Right, because might we, run into somewhere. No, <laughs> yeah, don't worry, your eyes closed. No crash. We need to look for a calf somewhere. I need a cash point as well. Calf? A cash point. Watch out, blood! Don't pull out on me, man. Pick a sleigh road. I like the sound of pick a sleigh. Mulvan Fire Station. So that's nice around here, isn't it? It is, eh? Nice little stream. <laughs> I wonder if that's got Mulvan water coming out of it. It's got a tap on there, isn't it? Very rare we had to pay anyway. No, I'll tell you what, no, we'll go straight up. Straight up? Straight up. <laughs> Steve's straight thinking. on. Have you found your voice here? No, yeah, I'm searching for it. I can't feel my fingers, so I... <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't really. I need to try... I've never likely put this army on and tried to... Uh, sort of locate it. What a stupid place to park a penguin. So... We need to park, so there's a park in there, or should we get here? We can all get in there, whack oh, them in. It's a bit of an angle though, isn't it? Look at that. It's a bit steep. We need somewhere, I'll tell you what, well, we'll go up here. There's meant to be somewhere up here. Yeah, I'll be riding, sure. Give, give way. Oh, look at this. I'm supposed I'm to give way here. Just gonna burn my clutch out now. Well, stored in all. I think there's a calf down there. <laughs> Should we go down there? Go on then. Yeah? Before I burn my clutch out. <laughs> hey, yeah, there's a car fire space there, though. That'll be Becker's range. Get in here, I'm here, now. Oh, I'm just in the car park. 
Ja, det gør det ikke. Ja, det gør det ikke. Let's get on and see if we can up the pie. Can say. Is the is the bike parking or anywhere? Have a look. Ah, huh? we're going to have a look. See if there's bike parking. Short stay, maximum two hours. Yeah, you're going to be two hours, aren't we? I can ask that guy. Yeah. Well, I'll look on the thing. Rich, over there. Where? Motorcycle bay, free parking. Oh. Okay, cheers. Oh. It's a bonus of having a bike. It's an advantage. We'll come back and we'll get there. There we go. Cheers, mate. Right. I love traffic wardens. Right. Surely see the traffic warden, they ain't a problem. Uh, well, talk, so like. But if you park illegal anyway, then you deserve to get it. Yeah. You can't argue with it. You can't argue with the ticket because you can't talk back to you. No. Oh, yes. Thanks, mate. Stand up. Where's your... Sam says to me, do what? Hey, come back, says always, get him. He goes, I've got a parking ticket. I says, you must have, I want, I want a park illegally. I says, I'll come back and send the centre out for him. It's in parked. We got by the white line. But the next one, the wore the white line, so she was, she was in the sp two white lines. Thank you. 